Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be something I think pretty timely. I know a lot of people are feeling stressed and anxious right now. I wanted to do a video ranking all of the CBD oils I've tried over the last few years. I'm gonna go through all four, ranking them and leaving the very best for last, so make sure you stay tuned to the end. When I first tried it, I was a little bit skeptical, but over the years, I've really found stuff that works for me and really helps manage my stress levels and also help me manage my TMJ pain. I suffer from jaw clenching and teeth grinding in my sleep. My TMJ pain is often triggered by stress and I need a little help in the stress management department. I will also be doing a video all about CBD beauty, so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss that. I have a lot of skincare and body care products to share in that video. All the CBD oils in this video are hemp derived, so you can buy them online. Number four on the list is the first CBD oil I really tried on a consistent basis. This is by the brand Rosebud. Very cool female founded brand. This is their old packaging. So since they've launched a couple years back, the packaging has been updated. The logo's changed a little bit. This is their 350 milligram bottle. I found that in the beginning, I would just add a couple drops to my coffee and gradually work my way up to half a dropper. It was a great introductory CBD, obviously a female founded brand, which I love supporting. So while I have the 350 here, they do offer higher doses on their website. So check them out, that is Rosebud. Next up we have Reed's Remedy Calm. And this is a really unique one because it's a spray. And the nice thing about a spray is that the dose is consistent. And this is the Calm blend. So this is a distilled hemp oil with terpenes infused. This bottle contains 500 milligrams of CBD. The spray design is genius because it's a controlled dose every single time, unlike a dropper where you really have to look closely to make sure you have an accurate dosing, especially if you're starting out and you're very sensitive. For a one spray serving size, you get 75 servings in one bottle. Really nice format, and it has a little bit of a grassy flavor, so it's very uplifting and awakening. Huge fan of this one. I really think the packaging is quite innovative. I've never seen another spray CBD oil, so definitely wanna try more from this brand. Ranking in at number two is Bloom Farms CBD oil. This is their Relieve Tincture. This bottle has 600 milligrams of CBD. Really nice box, really pretty frosted glass bottle, just very elegant, looks premium. So this brand uses 100% organically grown hemp and also 100% USDA certified organic MCT oil. Bloom Farms also has a really nice one for one initiative for every bottle sold. They donate a meal to a family in need. So when I was getting used to CBD, I was just kind of putting it in my coffee, a couple drops and gradually working my way up from there. By the time I tested this out, I was just using it in tincture form, just taking a half dropper or so and putting it under my tongue and letting that kind of absorb absorb in for 30 seconds to a minute. So I would use this in the morning kind of to curb the jaw tension and headaches I'd sometimes have in the morning from my TMJ. And then I'd also take it after lunch and in the evening time to kind of just keep me leveled off. And I feel like CBD truly has a compounding effect. If you take it once, you're not really gonna notice a whole lot, but if you take it daily, I feel like it has a true compounding effect and it helps kind of curb those anxiety and stress levels. At least that's been the experience for me. So really enjoyed this one from Bloom Farms. Love that it's out of Oakland. Love that it uses organic ingredients and had a pretty good taste, but number one definitely wins for taste. And so coming in at number one, the best CBD oil that I wanted to recommend is by Pachamama. And this is the natural, a 750 milligram CBD. It was founded by two brothers and they have a really inspiring story about overcoming addiction. And I encourage you to go check out their website or their Instagram to kind of get a feel for the brand. The only thing they could really improve on this would be the packaging. Sometimes I had a hard time opening this. So this has been my favorite CBD oil to date. I love the story of the brand. I love the taste. It has a very unique taste that's different to the other CBD oils that I've mentioned in this video. It has more of like a smoky rich taste to it versus like a hempy grassy taste to it. I can't quite explain it. This brand also has topicals and I've been trying their athletic rub. It's a very, very rich kind of body butter, sour, that you can put on sore muscles, achy joints, and stuff like that. And it smells like Girl Scout Thin Mint Cookies. It smells incredible. But anyways, that's the other product I've been trying from Pachamama that I love. But in terms of their CBD oil, it tastes the best. And I really like the story behind the brand. If you're curious, my affiliate link will be down below. I super appreciate your support. If not, just go check them out. I think that they're doing really cool things. All right, friends, those are all of the CBD oils for stress that I can recommend. You now know my absolute favorite. If you have a favorite CBD oil, definitely leave it in a comment down below so we can all check it out. So thank you again for watching. I will see you very soon in the next one.